With the closing of the Old Town Regal Warren Theater, some are now wondering if the same thing could happen in their small town, two hours outside of Wichita. The much loved nonprofit Twilight Theater in Greensburg is struggling right now. Kason Zena Tahar is here to explain. Zena. Craig, the 100 year old Twilight Theater isn't just a place to watch movies. It's also used as an event space, an auditorium, and a gathering place for the 700 people living in Greensburg and the surrounding area. The nonprofit wasn't in great financial shape even before the pandemic, but now things are worse. The Twilight Theater opened in 1917, but its century long legacy could be coming to a close. How are we going to keep the Twilight Theater open here when we have 800 people. George Ryan says he's troubled by the Regal Warren in Old Town Wichita shutting its doors. It has him wondering how a small town like Greensburg can keep its own theater afloat. The Twilight isn't just a space to watch movies. It also serves as an auditorium for local schools. I did a lot of my um, drama parts and stuff here. It's where Maverick Titus remembers performing in clumsy middle school music recitals. We're all young and not really don't have that pattern or beat, I guess. And so it's just <laughs> it's just fun to make the audience laugh a little bit. A shared love for the theater funded its return eight years after a tornado tore through Greensburg in 2007. The Twilight is still being kept afloat through donations. 16 year old Titus works on a local farm. He sponsored Sunday afternoons showing of Mission Impossible. This is a lot of times where we'll come on the weekends, have some fun, watch a nice movie together as friends, family. But business at the Twilight Theater is down 50% compared to 2017 before the pandemic. We weren't doing enough business then to warrant this theater being open as a theater all by itself. Brian hopes to rally the community to preserve the space, the hub of the arts in Greensburg. He says it will take a village to keep the twilight alive. Here for you, Zena Taher, KSN News 3.